We're in the year 2020 and if we're being honest with ourselves, technology is incredibly advanced and we're making strides that can push things even farther. Technological communications also has kept up and evolved very much. We now have smart devices which make communicating a lot easier and faster. But how did our communication evolve so much as it is now? First, from being cavemen, the first people of course already know how to communicate. As we've seen from other videos, they learned to use cave paintings to share their thoughts. And sometime, they eventually discovered fire and that's when longer distance communication was made through smoke signals. Not so many years, we have acquired transportation which are the working animals. Sending mails through couriers has been the key to make a quicker communication to faraway places. But not quite far though. We were stuck for long in using couriers until telegraphy appeared. It revolutionized the first long-distance communication that doesn't need any personal contact. It helped send information across the country faster than any vehicle. That's where the telephone comes in. It could actually be considered the greatest invention of the 19th century. As telephones have continued to evolve from landlines, switchboards to cell phones and cell towers, the use of telephones has shaped the way how individuals connect with each other. Fast forward to the present, mobile phones, particularly the smartphones that have become our inseparable companions today, are relatively new. In fact, mobile phones as we know them today have only been around in the last 20 years. After that, the internet has risen from nowhere which was the work of dozens of pioneering scientists, programmers and engineers which developed new features and technologies that eventually merged to become the information superhighway we know today. In many ways, the internet is expanding and changing communication as much as the telephone did in the 1800s. Programs and applications popped up, which is very helpful for e-learning, knowledge sharing, social connectivity, variety of media, file transfer, communication, and etc. And now in the present, smart devices are continually progressing and upgrading with new specific features. 5G is now on its way and we're excited somehow. Or am I the only one? Well anyways, do you think we can still apply and use the old ones we used like smoke signals in this era? Or riding horses? It is obviously inappropriate for we are already modernized and we are the effects of change. In the future, we'll be seeing more and the best of the best that will make communication the best and much easier. Thanks for watching and that's the evolution of communication through centuries. Stay tuned and see you in the next episode.